The Detroit Department of Transportation launched a public outreach program today. DDOT Reimagined aims to revitalize public transportation in the Motor City. Let's get out to Priya Mann at the Rosa Parks Transit Center. And Priya, this is a chance for everyday people to shape the future of this service. Yeah, that's right, Kim. And DDOT launched their mobile engagement center. They'll be traveling to bus stops across the city. They spent several hours here at the Rosa Parks Transit Center. The goal is to talk directly to riders, and riders want to see some significant changes. Hire more people. Get more people. Longtime bus rider Eric Reed says DDOT needs to focus on hiring more drivers and increasing the frequency of runs. I walk sometimes two miles, two and a half miles to get back and forth before work and when I get off work to get home because of the bus. DDOT reimagined wants this type of feedback as it redesigns the bus system from the ground up. We have added some service. It's been difficult to add as much service as we'd like because we're still short over 100 operators. But we are able to add service in locations that, at, at time frames that people said are an issue. This mobile engagement center is heading to bus stops across the city to meet with riders and drivers directly. We want to be out here straight away on the bus for hours and hours trying to get to work in the cold. So yeah, I think it's a good thing for them to talk to them and see how they feel about the situations and everything. Yeah, it's a good thing. Starting Monday, DDOT is adding morning and evening runs to multiple routes across the city and timetables will be adjusted to better reflect actual travel times along several routes. Phase two of DDOT's reimagined initiative will run through mid-June. Once we um, get all the information in, we take a look at the plan and what's realistic and then we go back and price it out. Yeah, the key here is funding. You can have all the ideas you want, but paying for it is another matter. Uh, DDOT says that they are going to be taking in everyone's considerations over the next eight weeks, and they expect to have a proposal with funding in about six months. Of course, we'll continue to stay on top of this story. Reporting live in downtown Detroit, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. We'll see how it goes. Priya, thanks.